it's still August although you wouldn't think so it's 6.30 on the morning on the morning? in the morning hashtag ATM sorry anyway 6.30 in the morning it's a Saturday it's the 30th of August 2014 it stopped raining it's calm it's a bit chilly it's supposed to be quite nice next week maybe an Indian summer Cardiff not because of the NATO summit and demonstrations and protest marches in Newport but those tiny rebel boys are having a Belgian beer festival which is good so off I go to the Daily Tech News Show. Cardiff, Queen Street, International. Ever. Emergency Willows and an extra long Daily Tech News note. Show. Recky. Yes. And we're in business. And this number one. And they must stop saying that. Red by Hawkshead, 4.2%. Possibility it's a red ale. Nice carpet. Hmm. Sharp. Slightly acidic, bit of finish. Sipping, I'm sipping, so I give that a B plus. Clears the throat. That sounds bad, but it's good. No issues with the pump clips, the field expedient, aka uh, photocopied. I love photocopied though. This is Jouster, as in Knights of Old. Goffs Brewery, G-O-F-F-S, 4% alcohol by volume. Looked it up, it's supposed to be a little bit fruity. Mm. I'd say it's a bit spicy. It's nice. Not great, but nice. B+. Plus. And I've beaten them to opening. Well, that makes me an alcoholic, but you know, whatever. How long are we away? Five and a half minutes. Orville Trappist, 6.2%. I think it's a triple. We'll try it. Oh. <laughs> A minus or B plus plus? Yeah, take away. A minus, easily. I've had the Gers version of this both here and then Mode Lambic, the original. This is Creek. It's 8%. Wow. Really, Creeks aren't that strong. But here we go. Not very much of a nose. It smells more like a goose. Extremely fizzy. Interesting taste on the uh, cherries. It's a bit of a corona taste to it actually, if you know what I mean. And the finish is slightly acidic, slightly sour. I don't know, I don't use the word complex, but it's complex, B++. Chips, chips, more chips. Urban Top House.
Belgian beer fest. Lots of it's not whiskey. It's this. This is Bravo Belgo Wit. Wit as in wheat. 5% alcohol by volume on draft. Hence no bottle. A light wheat beer. Quite a strong finish. Struggling, yeah, B plus. It's a good beer, but not great beer. I've been to the cafe. Mort Sedit means sudden death. Gers with two U's means it's Flemish. When I went there, um, I had a potato beer and a cappuccino with lots of cream on the top. Last time I had anything from uh, this brewer, which they buy it in, it's not the genuine stuff anymore. It was from Carrefour in Palma de Mallorca. You know. Anyway, this is 4.5% alcohol by volume. And it smells like a goose. <laughs> I've sweetened it. It's not an export bottle, but it's a B plus. If they hadn't sweetened it, it would have been plus plus because it smells wonderful. There was a lady from Belgium at the bar. Asked her if she knew was Flemish or French. She said she was Belgian, which is very polite. But when she read the bottle, she was French. Very nice, though. Anyway, Oud Bruin, Oud Brown, which is Flemish usually. 5.5% alcohol by volume, extra. An original glass. I'm still awake, which is a shocker. Oh. Oh. Quality brew alert, B plus plus. 